Simpson the Slug, early each morning, would wake to his clock as the new day was dawning. He'd slide from his bed and put his vest on. By the time he'd done this, the whole day was gone. So off went his vest and back into bed went Simpson the Slug, not a word being said. Hugging his teddy, he started to snore. And would you believe it? It was morning once more. Simpson, you see, was ever so slow. A great slimy slug who hadn't much go. And there our story would have come to an end if it wasn't for Squeaky, Simpson's best friend. Squeaky the mouse had a plan in his head to help his dear friend move from his bed. He spent all the next day in a shed with more mice, building Simpson the Slug a go-faster device. They wheeled him outside, all the mice gave a hand. He'd soon be the fastest slug in the land. Simpson was ready, speed was his goal. Then Squeaky pressed go on his handheld control. There followed a bang and a cloud of grey smoke. The mice all fell back and started to choke. As the dust settled, the scene became clear. There was nothing of Simpson except a small smear. Simpson the slug was a thing of the past. They knew that the second they all heard the blast. Life wasn't the same for the mice after that. They were filled full of guilt for making Simpson go splat. A year slowly passed. Then, from up in the sky, a shooting star fell and landed nearby. The mice all arrived and saw on the ground Simpson's old rocket with a postcard tied round. It was written to Squeaky, who read it out loud to all of the mice who'd formed quite a crowd. Greetings from Simpson, the postcard began. I've got a new life and a wife and a tan. Your rocket, it sent me shooting far into space. And I came to a world which is my kind of place. For everyone here, is as slow as can be. They're sluggish and slimy and move just like me. In under a year, I got married in style. And six months of that was the walk up the aisle. So I don't need a rocket to make me speedy like you, for I'm fine being me, the slug you all knew. We'll visit you one day, my new wife and I. But up until then, just look up to the sky. For the star to the left of the one to the right is the star where I twinkle each clear summer's night. It's a tiny green planet by the name of Glug Glug. It's my happy new home. Love, Simpson the Slug. You can't sit there! 